Well, dead bodies, death threats, and demands for money. This week, a Wilson County resident received bizarre text messages that the sheriff's office says are fake. News 2's Chelsea Bynfors spoke with investigators about how you can protect yourself from a scam like this. Usually once a week we have a report of some type of scam. Wilson County Detective Justin Cagle says the sheriff's office is constantly investigating fraud. But this week they came across something particularly disturbing. Someone in Wilson County received text messages and pictures threatening their life and demanding cash. One of the messages read in part, I'm an assassin. I was sent to terminate your life and you need to make a payment of $4,000 so I can terminate the contract from the person who sent me. This person notified us. We we let them know, um, you know, right away that that was a scam. Detective Cagle pointed out the bad grammar, misspellings and poor punctuation as signs that the messages are fake and noted that the photo the scammer included alluding they had killed someone was actually a screen grab from a recent news story where a San Diego sheriff's deputy passed out when exposed to fentanyl during a drug bust. The first thing we do is to suggest that they block the number. Um, not respond uh, at all to any of the messages. Cagle says if something doesn't seem right, it probably isn't. He wants to remind people to never give out personal information or money without vetting a situation or contacting law enforcement. If they're not sure, if it sounds even a little fishy, don't do anything. Um, ask somebody, contact us. Well, Cagle says elderly people are usually the prime targets and victims of texting scams like this one, and a lot of them originate from overseas. Once someone gets caught, Cagle says they just create a new scenario to see who else they can fool. If it happens to you, report it to local law enforcement.